shouldn't crumble like that. Nice and sturdy. There she goes. Pray the windows don't get smashed. What's going on guys? It's Peyton Fisher and on this channel we talk all things real estate and construction. Today we are starting a full house remodel. We're gonna be working on the outside first. So I'm gonna take you through putting in sewer drains for the RV pad. We've got the whole back patio being cut out and we're gonna be working on drains for the gutter. So let me show you where we're at right here. This is going to be a RV pad, 20 feet wide by 40 feet long. We're gonna have 10 foot gates right here. So today we've got the sewer clean out right there and we are gonna be trenching in a line all the way down back over here to put in the, the sewer dump for the RV right around here. We're gonna be taking these drain spouts. We're gonna plug in a four inch sewer pipe for the drains to push it all the way out here. And then here in the back, Today, we are going to be cutting out all of this patio all the way over there to that door there. That's all going to come out. You can see there the concrete is starting to break apart from different chemicals in the soils, which is really frustrating, but it is what it is. And then we're going to be getting prepped for the 14 by 24 foot uh, shed here in the back. Let's get started. All right, when we come back in here, I'll show you where the drain, the sewer drain is right here. So we're gonna clear this bush out and this bush out. We're gonna have the excavator take that tree out. We have this hole dug down to where we just hit the water main right here. So the plumber is gonna hook up to this, take that sewer, right out there for the RV pad. All right, so we thought that was the only water main, but over here, which right after I turned off the camera, it decided to explode and shoot right up my crotch. Uh, blasted this tree and I felt horrible, had to run out, turn off the water main. So we're gonna get this excavator going as quick as possible, dig this out, see what we can fix and uh, get some water back into the house. All right, so this is tree trimming with an excavator. Just push that back. So we're trying to figure out what line was hot over here. So that way we can uh, get that turned off and get it fixed when the plumber comes out. I mean, shoot. <laughs> no freaking <laughs> What we've got going here now is I'm digging a hole completely under this. So this dirt right here will slide under it. So I don't have to put any more pressure on that main line because I already busted it once, put a hole in there. The plumber said that's fine. He'll just tie pecs into that. And then we'll be able to dump all that dirt down and he'll be able to tie the other sewer right into this. All right, we're, we're back here on the concrete. We're cutting out this whole patio. Holy crap. We were worried that that was gonna be 18 inches all the way through, but it does shrink up at the top, which will make the cutting much easier. We now are standing on top of this patio roof because the foundation underneath uh, was actually poured in a way that the pillars down there we aren't able to uh, pull them out because there's too much weight. So what we're going to do now is the clients have okayed this whole entire removal of this patio or this patio roof, and we're gonna take it off. Yep. All right, so, oh shoot, this was the exterior of this roof. 
Go show them that board. Oh, shoot, that's kind of sketchy. Just, just pull them to that. Man. I can feel it like bowing. <laughs> Nice and sturdy. Okay, it gets hard back there a little ways further. There she goes. Pray the windows don't get smashed. Yeah, good job. Beautiful. I did. I did indeed. Woo! Good. Yeah! We were so exhausted on Friday that I actually didn't make an ending to this video. Let me just show you a quick view of what it looks like after we did everything this is the sewer pipe we've got all of this chaos going on over here the whole patio awning is gone and we are going to be rebuilding a a different one they don't know what exactly they want yet uh who knows we'll see so we'll see you guys on the next video